stock number 6072 has arrived and I'm very excited. This is an X ambulance four wheel drive from Japan. Let me introduce myself. My name is Phil Lee. I'm here with Lee's and Sunrise Cars. Working hard today, but I'm fizzing on this ambulance. This was something unusual that I saw. And when I realized that it had an extra high roof, higher than a normal super long wheelbase, and it was four wheel drive, and it had this wonderful ambulance fit out inside, I got very excited. So uh, first of all, as usual, it's got the extra ground clearance that you get. It sits a little bit higher than a standard two wheel drive. But this roof has been custom made by uh, a toy, it's actually done in the Toyota factory, this extra high roof. So this, you can do a folk dance in the back. You can do a bit of an, an Irish Highland uh, heel tap and you won't bump your head even if you're tall in the back of this ambulance. I guess I'll, this is what you want to be seeing, isn't it? Oh, look at that. Cannonball run. I'll just say those two words and some people will have a giggle, some won't get the joke. Um, I'm six foot high and I can stand up and even go up on my tippy toes and I don't hit my head on the roof. So this is pretty cool. Um, look at the fit out, look at the gear. Storage one, storage two, lighting, lighting, storage, storage. These are all cupboard spaces. This is handy if you want to know what time it is. Power points, yes, it's 110 volt in Japanese, but you can plug in your US or Japanese adapter and plug in your fridge or your hair dryer or whatever you like. Um, probably don't need these. Gas bottles, there's a little water distillery here. This is pretty cool here, look at this. You press this button here with your foot. That's your water pump for your little sink. Waste in waste uh, fresh water in waste out soap dispenser storage storage now this is where i put my fridge and this goes all the way to the outside of the vehicle so you can have your picnic space i'll show you that in a minute there's a whole control panel here rear air conditioning and heating i love this this is just an awesome machine there's more storage in here possible seating another seat Another storage under here. Probably would not keep the the blood uh, gurney there. We'll get rid of that. But there's a massive amount of built-in storage in this bad boy. There's another um, thing here where you can plug your power in. If you want to, once again, it's 110 volt. I'll let you get your head around that. I'm not changing it. Somebody else can if you want to. You might not need to. We fitted the off-road wheels and tires. We've got electric curtains on the back here. You can press a button from the front and they zip open and closed. This is a cool second door. One gentleman said he wanted to put a ladder on the inside of this door so he could put his surf skis on the roof, put your ladder here. But how it stands, this is where I put my fridge, which you can access from both sides. In here, house battery, ideal for a camper conversion and more storage under here. Big money has been spent on this fit out. It's very cool. This goes all the way, can go through to the inside here. Same here, you can go through. Not quite sure what this is, but it might be useful. It's an 07 done 182 k's just double check yep it's got these very sturdy uh leatherette style seats that i think if you sat on it with a wetsuit or a bit damp from the beach it's not going to go strange because i think it's really vinyl hard wearing seats designed for just that to be hard wearing there's another spot here where you can plug in to shore power once again it's a 110 volt system from US. You can see here it's got driving lights on the front. Very cool, very unique vehicle. If you're watching this video from interstate, call us for an interstate transport quote. We get very good deals and it will probably cost a lot less than what most people think to get this transported anywhere in Australia. 
course, being an ambulance, the car has been very well maintained. Service stickers are up to date. Japanese are very fastidious when these things are in public service. Uh, great care is taken with maintenance, as you can see there from that service sticker being up to date with the mileage on the vehicle. There's a whole nother row of cupboards in here for storage. There's another gurney that pulls out here for rescuing people or a lamp. A useful space, I think, for a camper conversion. Um, constant four-wheel drive. You can put a rear diff lock in these from a Hilux for about 2,500 bucks if you want to go hardcore off-road in this vehicle. Uh, that's it. I'm going to end the video. If you've got any more questions, call me. Our number is 02 0539 For the price, go to our website edwardlees.com.au or visit us in West Ride, Sydney. Thanks for watching this video. Signing off. Phil Lee. See ya.